Hi, this is JC. I'm going to do a dollar haul, and all this stuff is from the Dollar Tree. Now, I apologize for not doing a dollar haul last Friday, but um, I was sick. I had a sore throat, fever, all that mess, and now I'm left with a pretty good head cold. So if you can't you know, understand me real well, or it sounds like it, it's because I'm still congested. I still have a head cold. So, let me get a little comfy here. So, I'm just going to show you the things I bought. Everything's from the Dollar Tree. Um, and I've actually found some things this time. When I went, I did go last week. I went to the Dollar Tree and Hobby Lobby and Target and a couple other places and really did not find anything. Uh, the Dollar Tree, like every five or six weeks, the Dollar Tree is in transition from one holiday to the next. So I just tend not to find stuff during that time. So this was that was one of those times. So I didn't do a video because of that too. But let me just get in and show you what I found this week. Um, real quick, let's see. I'm going to take this apart because she stuck it in there. I found this little bin, which I think is real cute. And the way that it fastens is you kind of have to have them both going down at the same time. And then it closes like that. And I got this to store um, some little action figures and stuff like that. So if you, if you look at my last video, uh, I did one. Wednesday, this Wednesday and Thursday, and they were on uh, unboxing, blind bags of action figures, little Shopkins figures. So you can go check that out. So I got that to put some of them in. Then I saw this, and I thought it was really pretty. This little plaque right here. It's just a little, I don't know what you call it, plaque <laughs> I was made out of. But it says, look for the angels in your life. They are everywhere. So I thought this would be real cute just to have them on my desk or, you know, in the kitchen. I thought this was real cute. It doesn't have a hanger, but you could do that real easily if you wanted to. So I thought that was really pretty. So I got that. And they had two or three others like that with sayings on it. Uh, let's see. I'm just going to go through them in no particular order. I got this Star Wars puzzle. Now, the reason I got this is this is a little box. And you can see this is what the puzzle looks like. In this little box, to do this is a hundred pieces. So I'm real curious. The pieces have got to be like that big. So I think it would be a challenge. I haven't done a jigsaw puzzle in ages, but I thought this would be fun. So I picked it up. Plus, it's the um, old Star Wars, not the new, you know, the original characters. So, I like that. Picked up these. These are Global Beauty Care Retinol Cleansing Cloths, like face wipes to get makeup and stuff off. And I've heard, some, I've heard somebody else talk about these, and they really like them. So, I picked up one to see how I like it. They did have quite a bit of these. And there's 25 wipes in a bag. So we'll see how these work. Especially when I was sick. I didn't feel like going and doing the whole face routine, you know, getting the makeup off or cleaning my face. So I really wanted to get some cleansing cloths for that that I could use. Oh, right. Let's see. Grab some stuff. Okay. I got these. I'm going to keep one. And I'm going to give one to a friend. To see how, you know, because she likes plants and stuff. These are little pots. And these are Veggie Pals Learn and Grow Perry Pepper. So I think it would be fun. I'm going to try one. I'm not real good at plants. But I got one for her and one for me. So we'll see how that goes. And on that vein, I also got, let's see where they're at. Hmm, here we are. These were real cute. These say they're fairy catcher kits. Grow your own beautiful blooming plants that attract fairies. Well, first I want to know how they know that, but they're really pretty. And 
it says grow five blooming flip that's hard to say grow five blooming fairy plants so I got those and they were a dollar and it has um, tells you how to do it and it comes with a pot and everything and your plants contains five colorful varieties of plants uh, each of these plants has an enchanting history many people throughout the ages have believed that these flowers can lure fairies to their gardens make potent potions and keep humans safe from mischievous magical creatures now you can grow your very own fairy garden so we'll try oh that's the back part so we're gonna I'm gonna keep one and give one to my friend so again I got two of these um, since I've been sick, I just picked these up. Vitamin C supplement drops in a package. And there are 30 drops in here, which isn't bad for a dollar. So we'll see how those work. I gotta tell you, I, I didn't bring it in. I just I picked up some groceries at Kroger. I needed like ground meat and stuff because I want to make a meatloaf. But um, I grabbed one of their bottles of uh, orange juice, the Kroger brand orange juice. It was like 98 cents. It was so good. It was one of those, you know, kind of tall bottles. So if I ever go around Kroger's, I'm definitely going to buy more of that because it was really good. I enjoyed that. Uh, picked up another thing of duct tape in a colorful stripe pattern. Thought that was pretty. And then I picked up this, which I thought was pretty cool. This is a wall tap. You can, this is a three-pronged wall tap, and then you can make a single prong into three prongs. So there are a couple of places I need this. So I picked that up. So I thought that was pretty cool. And they also had it in just the, the um, two-prong type, and it, it like folded over. So it was a little bit different. But uh, yeah, I thought I gotta need that. So I picked that up got me because I can't find my the other one I have so I got me another permanent marker a large permanent marker and I use these for signs or I also use them for like pieces of mail like big envelopes so I can just you know draw through my name so I pick up another one of these so I can cover up the address and I got this real cute this is a set of three it has uh, 50 sticky notes, 50 sheets notepads, two, and two 50 sheet notepads. So I thought this was real cute. It looks like a dress, and then it looks like a high heel boot. And then this right here, I'm assuming, is your sticky pads. So I thought that was real cute for a dollar. And they had another style of these, too. Got this. It's a 3-in-1 flashlight laser and stylus. But that was real cute. Another flashlight to have handy. Because this would be real easy to drop in your purse. So I thought that was cute. And they had it in a couple more colors. Uh, picked up. I thought I picked up two of these. Let me see one. Oh, I must be in the other bag. Uh, these Velveeta cheese. Just to have in the cabinet. Because I was really craving macaroni and cheese the other day. And all I had was the big box. And so I like the idea of just having the individual, you know, in the cabinet just to keep around. Because when I was really sick, I didn't feel like making a whole lot. And that would have made me a meal. And then I got the uh, car air freshener, Mountain Falls. I don't know what it smells like. Um, let's tear one in. Let's get into one. And again, I might not smell it very good with my sinuses. So just let me get in there. Ooh, that, this reminds me, this reminds me of, um, what you call it, of um, clothes, softener sheets. This reminds me of softener sheets. And the reason I picked these up, and they're, they come, again, three to a package. The reason I picked these up is I got in my car this morning to go do my shopping, and it smells like onions. Now, that could have been from a hamburger or something we picked up to eat, but I can't find it. I can't find anything like that laying in the car. So I don't know why my car smells like onion. 
but that's what I got these for to combat that smell. I can't find anything. Uh, let's see. Pull these out. I got these. I wasn't going to buy anything else to put in my great niece's Valentine packs, but I saw these up on the shelf and I couldn't resist. <laughs> They're pens. Look at this big old pen. It's huge. It's a big pen. This one is frozen. This one is Little Mermaid. I mean, it's a pen. I mean, is that not cute? And this one is Mickey's. Mickey, does it say parade or party? Mickey, Mickey Park is what it says. It's got Mickey Mouse on it. And I always have to get three different kinds again so they won't fight over whose is whose. So I picked those up and those will go in their bags. And then I got, here's my other, here's my other Velveeta. I know I had two. And then, I'm almost done. Picked up some more of these. I've already eaten the one box that I bought last time. These are the fruit and grain mixed fruit cereal bars. This is, looks like apple and strawberry. I think the last one I had was actually cherry. But, um... Yeah, it was cherry, but I picked up two of these because I really like these. Uh, I, I'm pretty sure the last one I bought was actually cherry, but these are really good. So I picked up some more of these. Another one of these. Picked two of those. And I picked up the apple cinnamon cereal bars to try. So we'll see how this one tastes. But I like them. I I like them because one, you can taste the, the fruit and what have you in them. And number two, they're not real sweet. They're not overly sweet. So I really like those. And lastly, they did have some DVDs this time. So I picked up this one. Never heard of most of these, but they sound interesting, except for one. I'm going to save that. Well, do it there. Uh, this is Boynton. I guess I used to say it. Boynton Beach Club. And what I like is it has some great actors in it. That sounds interesting. It has Joseph Bologna, D Diane Cannon, Lynn Carew, Sally Kellerman, Michael Norrie, and Brenda Vaccaro, to name a few. And it just sounds interesting. And it celebrate life, love, and finding happiness again in this heartwarming co comedy that proves 60 is the new 40. So I think I'll enjoy watching this. So I picked that up. This one is called Blue Smoke. Alicia Witt, Matthew Settle, and Scott Bakula. It's called Blue Smoke. And it's get ready for a suspenseful ride with a movie that's all about passion, family, food, and fire. After witnessing an uncontrollable blaze burn, her family's pizzeria to the ground. Um, la, 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 it goes on and on and on. But it just sounds like a good old-fashioned love story, you know, family story. So about that one. This one sounded real interesting. It's called South Riding, a tale of conflicted love at the heart of a community in turmoil. And doesn't say who that is. Uh, Andrew Davies, Bleak House, and it goes on, um, about a insightful, warm, and full of memorable characters. A fraught love story and paints a panoramic portrait of a Yorkshire community in the long aftermath of the First World War. So, so I think that sounds interesting. So I'm going to watch that. And then lastly, I was so shocked to find this in the Dollar Tree. And I wish I could have found more like this. If you haven't seen this, um, I don't know where you can find it, but it is more than worth watching. And it's called Where Angels Go, Trouble Follows. If you haven't seen it, you need to see it. Um, it's about these nuns who take a school bus full of young girls across country. And it's got Stella Stevens and Rosalind Russell. And just to name a few, um, I just, I love this movie. So I'm excited to have found it for a dollar. So, pretty cool. So, that's what I found at the Dollar Tree today. Um, 
I hope you found that interesting. I hope you found a few things that you might go look for. Uh, I was really surprised to find as much as I did. But, as always, if you find it interesting and you want to see more videos, please subscribe. Please feel free to comment and give it a like. Um, take care, and I will talk to you later. Bye for now.